ran yourself into an Olympic final. How are you feeling? Uh, I, do, I don't know. I really don't know. It hasn't sunk in. I'm just delighted. I'm absolutely delighted because it's just... Again, like yesterday, it could have gone either way. And I just felt really good and warm up, felt really relaxed and, and pumped. You know, yesterday I was a lot more nervous because I was in the unknown. You know, I'd only run 50 points in Amsterdam and, and I wasn't sure was I was coming out here as a 30 point runner or 49 or a 48. I just completely skipped 49, straight down to 48 and low 48 today. I, I'm ecstatic, thrilled, and uh, I can't wait for the final now. It, it, like I said today, I kept telling myself this is wide open and it's still wide open, you know. Since the Europeans, which was four weeks ago, what have you changed? I've actually just been able to train properly, really. <laughs> um, nothing has really changed. I think I've just started, you know, bit by bit, even like over here in the last two weeks, things have just started to click. You know, I've started to find my rhythm again, started to run relaxed, started, you know, I was getting my, my starting one, two, three hurdles right, and everything just came together literally within the last couple of days. Um, and other than that, the only thing that really changed was I came into this real relaxed because there was no target on my back, there was no pressure. And uh, I think that definitely helped on the, on the mental side of things. I was watching the stride pattern. You did change a little bit up the home straight. You went to 15s as opposed to your 14s. Yeah, it just felt more comfortable, more relaxed. I thought, like, and I was chatting to Haley last night and she said just to stick with the 15s down the home straight because it meant I was able to attack rather than having to kind of bound into them a little bit. So, yeah, it worked. And I'm, I'm, I'm not going to argue with it. You were so strong coming into the home stretch. There was a point there I thought you may go back, but you found, I don't know what you found, but you found something that just pulled you right through. I found something just in the back of my head that said, if I don't kick on, I'm not going to get to the final. So uh, <laughs> that was enough motivation. Like just, I mean, when I when I came over, like I know I have a strong finish and um, I just kind of used that to my advantage. I didn't, didn't panic, stayed relaxed around the top end and came up on hurdle eight, hurdle nine. I kind of nearly knew if I can nail these again now, I, I have this. And yeah, here I am standing now, ready, ready for a final in two days' time. Forty-eight point thirty-nine seconds. That's the time we actually. That's your, <laughs> that's your national record, new national record. Unbelievable, unbelievable! I cannot, really cannot believe it. I've, I'm, even when the, when the time came up, I didn't know where to look in the stand. I couldn't find anyone. I found, I think Anton Burke and, and <laughs> or being a couple of people up in the stand. My parents, I think, were around uh, the top, the two hundred mark again, but. Uh, just absolutely thrilled, delighted, so excited. You were setting up your blocks and you seemed to be on the track for what seemed like an eternity. What, what was going through your head just before you got into those starting blocks? Going, uh, I don't even know. I was looking around for all the Irish flags at first and I uh, spotted a couple. And then I was just thinking, you know, like what I, what I need to focus on. So like attacking at the first hurdle, you know, staying nice and relaxed down the back straight, getting into my stride driving off hurdle five and six, staying focused on the top end and then drive home. And that was just, I kept relaying that in my head in the last two days. So your day recovery, Thursday's the final. That's a nice feeling. I sh I'm shaking. It sends, it's really sending a shiver down my spine. It's, it's amazing. I'm delighted. The pressure's off you now, Tom. So what are you going to do over the next 48 hours? Just chill out. Just, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, just go home, relax, get a good night's kip. Up tomorrow, just get a, get a bit of physio in. Just relax, go start refocusing again, come down off this high like I'm I'm I'm, I'm a nervous wreck I'm, here. I'm, I'm shaking too, so I'm shaking too. <laughs> so yeah, just come down off this high and, and, and get ready for the, the final. Well it's an amazing achievement. I'm delighted to see you in the Olympic final. I can't wait till Thursday. Lovely. Quite brilliant. Really, really